Here's part two of general scroll saw blade information. So when you're looking for scroll saw blades, they typically come numbered one through 12. And the rule of thumb is that the lower the number, the higher the teeth per inch or TPI. The higher the number, the lower the TPI. So when you look at your scroll saw blade packages, you'll see the number of the blade here, that's a number two, and that's a number 12. The next number you'll see is the teeth per inch. So this one here is 15, this one here is eight. So again, the lower the number, the higher the TPI, the higher the number, the lower the TPI. The lower number blades are typically better if you're looking at cutting something really thin, fine, or detailed. They're a very accurate cutting blade. The higher number blades are more aggressive and can handle thicker woods or stack cutting if that's something that you're looking to do. Um, the next numbers that you'll see on the blade pack refer to the thickness of the blade. So that's this number here. And then the next number is the kerf or the trace. This is the amount of material that's going to be removed as you cut. So the lower number blades, they have a higher TPI and it's a thinner blade, which is why they're good for detailed work. The higher number blades take more material away, but they're much more aggressive cutting so they can handle much thicker woods or things like hardwoods if that's what you're looking to cut. Um, if I were to recommend a blade to you if you've never scrolled anything before, I would recommend a number five blade. A number five blade is great because it's a mid-range blade. It's not too aggressive like a 12, but it's not super fast and thin like a number two. So that would be my recommendation if you're just starting up. Go with the mid-range blades, get a variety pack, and see what works for you. Do you think I need to do a part three? Here's part